Épisode 2 du mois de carrière, Carrier Ring. On va commencer à continuer tout de suite avec le prochain match contre les Magic encore. Moi, je joue à l'extérieur aujourd'hui. Contrairement au dernier match. Et, regardez, on a joué. J'ai joué un match entre temps. On a gagné 96 et 57. Plus qu'ici, quand même. Là. Ça a été un gros match, quand même. Donc, on va continuer avec ce troisième match tout de suite. Et voilà, on va commencer sans perdre de temps juste ici. Là. Bon, encore le même. Les mains, on joue à l'extérieur aujourd'hui. On va changer de chandail, je crois. On va mettre un nouveau truc. On va garder avec le noir quand même. On va garder ça bien simple. Et voilà. On va passer tout de suite juste ici. C'est pas bien long. On va débuter ça ici. C'est pas très très long. Bon, 70% maintenant. All you gotta do is just, just hop. Yeah, that's it. That's, it. that's all you gotta do. It's real like simple. It. Like it. It's real simple, you know. Et on continue maintenant tout de suite. On va commencer ce match. On va essayer de contre les Magic. On va essayer de gagner. Et là, on va passer ça tout de suite. On va commencer ce match sans perdre de temps. Et c'est pas mal parti. On va changer un petit truc ici. Et voilà, c'est parti maintenant. On passe ça là. Pas une match à l'extérieur. Aujourd'hui, contre les Magic. Le premier match à l'extérieur. Jordan C qui ne peut prendre le ballon. Tout ici qui me sent bien quand même. There's always going to be some big surprises in store, and, and I think this season they'd have to be bon, considered one of the biggest Gordon of them all. No question, and we're deep enough into the season to know, hey, this hasn't happened by accident. accident. They are genuine contenders here. Here are the starters for Brooklyn. Irving and Levert are at the one and two. Wilson Chandler out there with Jordan. And it's KD in at the three. And for Orlando, Fultz and Ross pair up to make the backcourt. At the four and the five, we have Gordon and Vucevic. And it's Isaac in at the three spot. And here's Vucevic after the three-pointer from Katie. Vucevic, the pass to Fultz, six to shoot. And the layup's good off the glass. Both these teams' doors relying tonight on the execution in their half-court game. A little bit of a throwback, sort of an old-fashioned approach tonight. Don't worry, we're going to have plenty of highlights. It is the NBA. We know there are great players on both sides of the ball cap, but how about the ability to execute under duress of a 24-second shot clock? It's going to be really interesting to watch. This is a problem, in plus. Irving dishes to Chandler. Back to Irving. Outside, KD. Again, the Nets for two. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early, and he's delivering. They know that if this guy goes off, their chances of winning rise exponentially. On the basket, Gordon. On the basket, Gordon. Over Jordan. Oh, and again, it's Orlando converting. Well, anytime someone can knock down mid-range jays, it opens up the floor. Nikola Vucevic doing just that. Now, here's Irving. And coming up is solid outing against Portland. And that's a great piece of work to get to the hoop there. Just tore the D. Just ran. Cross against Levert. Now here's Fultz. D right on him. And here's Ross. He had a 12-point outing in their last game against the Bucks in Milwaukee. Well, this is what you call your big man playing big. Terrific shot selection. And the Bucks have been playing well this season. Well, this is what you call your big man playing big. Terrific work on the glass. Now here's Irving. Durant kicks to Irving. Durant the pass to Irving. And it's two points to the win. Nice assist from Durant. And it's seven points for Kyrie Irving. Great ball movement there. On reste ici quand même. On fait attention. Faut aussi que je ne peux l'intercepter en fait. Man in his first quarter, three minutes played. Qui est à mal pour nous? Faults the pass to Gordon. 
Here's Vucevic. Vucevic Great D that time from Jordan. Jordan. Boy, in that close, he's almost automatic. Boy, that's pretty good defense. Wow. And you look at this Magic roster, so much potential. I think, Greg, they have done a great job of drafting to the style of play they want to play. Guys who want to get after the defensive end. Guys who can switch and slide on the perimeter. Guys who can protect the rim. That is the backbone of this organization. And now the first time out call here for the Magic. This game coming after a loss against the Bucks. Hey, they, they had their opportunities, but let's face it, they showed it from the line. Hard to win that way on the road. Well, you know this, Greg, because you played in the NBA. You've got to stand in and deliver from the free throw line, even in a tough environment, and they failed to do so. Catching up on the changes for Orlando. Bamba has checked in for Vucevic. Randolph comes in for Gordon. Al Farouk Amino, he's checked in for Jonathan Isaac. And DJ Augustine subbed in for Rock. Once again off the mark, Orlando. And here's Brooklyn. They're on a 15-4 run. Now here's Irving, guarded by Fultz. Too long in the paint, and he's hit with a three-second violation. Boy, DJ Augustine, the number nine pick in 2008, has certainly been well-traveled in his career. And so he hits the technical free throw. The thing that maybe puts me in awe more than any other skill is the way Kyrie Irving can change gears. This guy has a variety of ways to attack and keep defenses off balance. And you can't help but pick their defense apart. They're completely in disarray. Fultz with the ball. Now Chandler defending. Here's Randolph. Randolph the basket is off the assist from Fultz. Well, Markel Fultz continues to develop his floor awareness. Passes like that will create all kinds of chemistry. Je parle le ballon ici. Stolen by Bamba. About Bamba seven seconds to break the shot. Si, in in Fultz. Boy, that's one he wishes he could have back, especially against soft defense. Irving finds Jordan. And Jordan two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. Well, DeAndre Jordan's Jordan a problem because, because if he gets that close, you know the defense has to commit to him. him. Brooklyn shooting their second and third free throws tonight. And talking about last season, this team hit just 74% of their free throws. I'm sure they were hoping for better than that. Well, he's come through for them at the line today. He's been on the line. 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 He might just be six feet tall, but there is incredible strength packed in that body. You can tell he enjoys the contact. Now, Levert. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Over Fultz. Over a nice shot by Levert. Yeah. We're seeing some fireworks from them already. Well, what I love is the game plan is solid from the opening tip. And guys are making their shots. That's critical. And so it's the Brooklyn Nets holding on. Je l'en fais un, mais c'est lui qui a tiré à la place. One of the league's best point guards, Kyrie Irving, had this. 2011, I came into a league where the. Some say Greg a golden age at the point guard position. Yeah, and Irving right there with the best of them. Uh, he embraces the challenge. And welcome back to the second quarter of action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but bon, this one has been one sided so far. Plus, the guys, plus. the Nets enjoying a nice lead here. The, the offense instant. firing on all cylinders. They Le dominated that aussi. first period. That's exactly the start you want. You take maintenant. complete command. Now you've got to maintain that focus. Steve, si qui tire, ça All filled up and ready to go. Let's si. reset the lineups. Courtesy of Gatorade as the second ah, quarter gets going. Instant. Setting the floor for the Nets. The the floor Levert si and Durant pas. out on the perimeter. DeAndre Jordan is out there with Wilson Chandler, and it's Irving in at the one. The Nets had to be so judicious and so smart with every move they made because they did not have top draft selections. So you have to use cap space to acquire picks. They had to find sleepers in the draft. They had to find players who were probably undervalued and then develop those players. This is an organization that used every tool at their disposal. And keeping us updated from the sideline, let's swing it over to David Aldridge. Okay, Paul Ballon, the run kick. Kenny Atkinson, who's a native of Long Island, now has his dream job, coaching the Brooklyn Nets. He doesn't need praise or recognition. 
Instead, he's fueled by the fear of failure. Kevin, he's got his team playing with that same determination. David, he sure does. Thank you very much. Je perds le ballon ici, c'était pas prévu. The net showed they could manufacture a si le ballon, en fait. Kevin, what the Nets did was not easy. But to je perds le ballon ici, je ne sais pas ce qui se passe en fait. Quality front office personnel ballon ici qui rentre en problème, j'ai quelques petits problèmes ici. And the Nets were on point throughout the process. The three from Katie. Katie. Yes, yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Irving is going to reprendre. the assist tonight. The assist totals, Kevin, just continue to grow. Way ahead in that category. Trois minutes, une ou deuxième quart. Ball movement has been flawless. Now, now it's time out called by Orlando. 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 His time in Boston had clearly come to an end by the finale of last season. Now joins up with a new stat team. Catching up on the changes for Orlando. Vucevic checked in for Mohamed Bamba. Gordon comes in for Zach Randolph. Jonathan Isaac, he's checked in for Al Farouk Aminu. And it's Ross in for Fultz. Hits it from three-point range. He's going to force them to have to make adjustments. That's number four in terms of triples in the half. Augustine passes to Ross. And stolen by Kyrie Irving. Ross has the breakaway lane. Irving's got eight points in the quarter. Well, talk about a one-man show. Irving makes the play with the defense and converts with his offense. The Magic trail by 18. If now they force the trick, they don't get it like that. And stolen by Irving. They change the trick like that. Plays it in off the breakaway. Irving has got 21. Bien spécial, on va se plus tard dans cette petite carrière qu'à Real Ring. Le Greg c'est lui, on va quand même faire quelques petites questions dessus. Si on peut. On reste dessus quand même. Rossi qui récupère. Rossi qui fait de l'espace, en haut de panier. Qui est qui est bloqué, récupéré, ça rentre pas plus. C'est pas le gars que vous voulez dans votre zip code quand le ballon est tombé sur Deandre Jordan deux fois sur les pipes. Je demande ici qu'il récupère un dunk ici. Kevin Durant avec une petite crafty creativity KD à la rim. C'est Augustine, je n'y suis pas arrivé. Augustine up top. He's covered by Irving. And Vucevic kicks to Isaac. Pass to Augustine. Clock is at three. To end the run. And that's collected by DeAndre Jordan. Nets leading by 22. Well, you think about the solid first year Steve Clifford had coaching the Orlando Magic. This team had a solid season with a great leap on the defensive end of the floor. Clifford once again showing he is a great defensive mind in the NBA coaching ranks. Time call here. The Magic decide to talk it over. And with Clifford and the defense, he's excelled in that area his whole career. Well, think back at both stops in Charlotte and Orlando, his teams have been really solid on the defensive end of the floor. They win the turnovers and second chance points. Get back in transition, build the wall. It's becoming his calling card as a coach, guys. Augustine looking around. There's 38 seconds left in the first half of the game. And now the fast break, Irving with the ball. 23 seconds left now here in the second. Beyond the arc, and again, and Brooklyn with the triple. It's impressive the level of domination at both ends, and you're seeing the results. And Greg, you know this. It's not easy building a lead on the road, but this team has been lights out throughout the game. You can just see the frustration growing on their faces. Nothing going their way. It's just been one of those games, and they need to find a way to turn it around before it gets completely away from them. And it's a three-pointer to fall. 
Thank you, David. We'll be back after the start of the second half. On troisième call. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Et on Hello, Paul Turney Johnson here. Kyrie Irving was red hot to start the first. He ended up with 33 points, four steals, and four assists. And it's just about time now for the third quarter to get up. On va avec le troisième quart. Enfin, nous passer pour bien jouer. Ce prochain quart. And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. You look at Kyrie Irving in this game, he has been everywhere. Yeah, something that isn't his strength, but he's done a great job of finding the open man. Well, what he did was sustain it throughout the first half. He ran the offense to absolute perfection. At the four and the five, we have Gordon and Vucevic. Fultz and Ross pair up to make the backcourt, and it's Isaac in at the three spot. So that's the lineup on the floor for the Magic. A lot of competitors in this league, Doris, and you've got to be that way to play at this level. I know you have a list of competitors that you admire a lot. It's those guys, Kevin, who have that insatiable desire to win. The guys who absolutely despise losing, who it almost hurts. It's painful physically. Giannis Antetokounmpo is driven to be great. He wants an NBA championship. LeBron James has got multiple titles and continues to pursue greatness. What I love about great NBA Ouais. players it's never enough Kevin you pour réussir il faut d'autres positions pour Kevin Durant it's good c'est le six six en premier and you know he's enjoyed the kind of day you expect in terms of shooting the basketball he can bring them right back into this game a miss like that will drive any scorer crazy especially with the defender getting a cushion avec un tir ça n'arrête pas Jordan with the rebound Jordan's got nine rebounds now tonight. Le Magic qui fait de l'espace, on sent le Bird qui tire un trois points. Qui rentre pas malheureusement. The Magic have gone one of three since starting the second half. To the middle, here's Isaac. Qui est qui rentre ici de Isaac qui est ici de Isaac. Volts has got three assists now in this one. This is encouraging to see Jonathan Isaac finish the contact. He obviously will fill out that frame and add some weight, but the balance is really impressive. He can't just pull the ball in the air and catch the ball. Zach Randolph, he's checked in for the Magic. Just a little over 90 seconds gone in the third quarter. Okay, well, let's go down to David Aldridge for a report from the sideline. Well, for Nick Vucevic, there were some great first last season. His son, Philip, was born in December. And then, Dad made his first All-Star appearance. Nick is from a basketball family. He said, I'll enjoy telling my son the story, like my dad did with me. We'll see if he likes the game of basketball. I think he will. Kevin? LDA, it's certainly in his genes. Thanks for that report. Ross against Levert. Gordon, he's fit bien de l'espace, là, en fait, là. On the wing, Gordon. Six on the shot clock. Kicks it to Fultz. Hits the front of the rim and out. This has not been a good period for this guy. Out of sync, not letting the game come to him. He's got to settle down and make shots. KD, that's for two. He doesn't hit that one. So Orlando will take it the other way. They'll be playing host to Miami for the next game. And that's game two of this string of four games played at home. The Nets have gone three of six in the third quarter, 50% from the field. And at this point, there simply is no doubt that Kevin Durant is one of the great shooters to ever play the game. The, the only question is just where on the all-time list will he land when we talk about the unstoppable score. Now Chandler defending. And he in the way up off the glass. Oh, great production on the interior right now. Eight straight from inside. Durant dishes to Irving. Back to Durant. Durant is the one who takes the ball. Kept alive. He didn't pull. He's going to shoot the opportunity. Irving finds KD. Durant is the one who takes the ball. He didn't pull. He's going to shoot the opportunity. Irving finds KD. Back to Durant. Perhaps the most amazing part. Durant is the one who takes the ball. He can have quiet nights, Greg, of 30 plus points. This is going to be so easy for him that you forget you aren't supposed to see seven-foot sharpshooters doing it. 
He can score from anywhere in any fashion and can hold his own with any player in history in terms of how unguardable he is. You can see it. Once this guy gets his rhythm, he is so hard to slow down. What an excellent night for him and his team. Bolts the pass to Ross. Now here's Randolph. Randolph Levert see. defending. Shot from the wing. Et and Randolph with the basket on the assist from Ross. Six points for Zach Randolph. Yeah, great anticipation of where the open man was going to be. And Terrence Ross finds him immediately. That's really pretty. We've got 28 seconds left here in the third quarter. The Nets need to get a shot off here. For three, Durant, and it's Randolph with the rebound. Well, two long-range bombs in the first, but that's stalled out right now. Launches it. Connects again from distance. Buries his 10th triple of the game. Unbelievable. And another steal for him. And that's his sixth steal of the night. Imposing his will. Durant is with a dunk. Boy, there is an ease with Qui which Kevin Durant problème. plays the game. This guy knows I can score from anywhere Et right si now. Quarter, and at the end of the third quarter, quarter, a huge lead, and this one may already have been decided. Je vais aller faire ça. Coaching on deck, on est match. J'ai réussi à faire ça. And let's go back to a terrific pass that we're calling tonight our State Farm assist of the game. And the winner today, the big fella here with the sweetest of dimes. What a plus it is to have a post player who's got this ability to find. Well, we have some elite passing big men in the NBA, and you love that skill. Wow. And one quarter to go in a game that to this point has not si. been an evenly fought contest. So for Brooklyn now, Irving and Levert are at the one and two. Wilson Chandler out there with Durant, it's and it's Williams Jordan in at the si. five, roaming the paint. Carter Williams, six foot as well. Carter Williams, the pass to Birch, and Jordan sends it back. They have been board dominant in this game. That's definitely oh. been a factor in We're crafting this huge lead. Kyrie Irving doing work with the pass. That's pretty. Westy seems to be coming. Now here's Carter Williams, and so Orlando again turning it over. Let's see what the Brooklyn Nets have coming up on Monday. They'll be matching up against Kyle Lowry and the Toronto Raptors. Then on Wednesday, they'll be taking on Jonas Valanciunas and the Memphis Grizzlies. Jordan kicks to Irving. Remember the time, Doris, when it was rare to see stars changing teams? Now we read about it every day. No question, Kevin. Think back to my formative years watching the NBA as a fan. Larry Bird was a Boston Celtic. Magic Johnson was a Los Angeles Laker. The trend in today's NBA is that shorter player contracts, more player uh, control over where they want to be. And the reality is this, Kevin, at some point, uh, free agency entered the equation. It's appropriate. It's aussi se mettre en vue plus en mode carrière. On va faire ça comme ça ici. C'est fair, they've earned the right to choose where they play. Plus spécial, mais c'est ici un petit peu. Here's Carter Williams. Carter Williams qui arrive avec un dunk, c'est bien puissant. And dropping the sledgehammer there, he curbs a 10-0 run by the net. Outside Durant. Carter Williams again serving over Aminu. And again, it's Brooklyn converting. In such a rhythm right now, feathery touch. Et bien He's lighting them up. Rent. And it's Carter Williams with the ball for the Orlando Magic. Passes it to Aminu. Back to Carter Williams. Poked away. Si. Si. Mais c'est Caspi qui intercepte qui récupère le ballon. Ah, c'est toujours ce Carter Williams. Right side. Five on the clock. And now Irving pushing it up. No one back to stop him. All alone. And Katie throws it down. I'll tell you, right now, these guys. I'm going to return to the camera ordinary. C'est ça ici que je voulais. Je l'ai maintenant. Et ça je voulais utiliser. Et voilà, je crois avec ça. He's making history, tied for third most steals 
in a single game. Incredible continues to hound the ball. And this is what you want on both ends to win the battle of effort. And that's exactly what you can control, right? Your desire, your hustle, your will to succeed. Back to Irving. The pass to KD. The three. Around the seven, can't throw a point. Can't throw. But they get it back. Outside Irving. It's good. 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 Durant, Durant qui down low. Bien, mais Aminu on him. Can't connect from contre. short range. And it's Carter ici, Williams. That time by the assist by Gatsby. Carter Williams has got six here in this quarter. Irving against Carter Williams. Durant Over ici avec deux points qui rentrent. C'était très juste, mais ça rentre quand même finalement. And that's now 33 points for KD. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. Yes, and, and, and with this one winding down, it's obvious to everyone who watched it. Just a total mismatch and a true show. And as one-sided as it gets today, you know, there were some dominant moments in there about every facet of this game for that team. Yeah, I mean, Kevin, I, it's hard to think of what didn't go right for them. Uh, game planning by the coaches, execution by the players, everything was just on target. And ever win important, and this one will go down as win number three. And as we get set to put this one to bed, a one-sided season series thus far. They Donnez ma caméra, je préfère le caméra, j'ai habitué c'est ainsi avec l'autre. Celle-là ici, et on revient à la normale. And one of the key components to this victory, if not the biggest, was the incredible performance for Kyrie Irving. Boy, I have loved this guy's energy all night. There was never a point in which he let up. The triple double uh, evidence of the kind of effort and skill he has. Spirited performance. You love to get this kind of win, especially on the road. You've got to be able to block out all distractions in enemy territory. This team did a tremendous job staying focused on the task at hand. De temps pour tirer Here ici, is Caspi. He's guarded by Chandler. I can see this. Pass to Birch. Birch. Here's Aminu. And a miss there on the triple. Irving dishes to Durant. From past the arc. Six more points ici. Qui ne rentre pas. C'est la fin du match. And so it's Brooklyn easily grabbing this one. A resounding victory for them. All right, David. Thank you. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, and bon, David Aldridge. Ça quand même, malgré tout. On va voir les stats maintenant. 12 en 13, mais 3 points. J'ai fait un gros match de 3 points. 35 points pour Durant. C'était pas si mal, malgré tout. Quand même bien été joué. Bon. Avec quelques matchs, on va aller, je vais aller faire une petite modification sur Durant. Je vais faire des. Sur le Gary Irving, je vais faire des nouveaux trucs, des dunks. Peut-être même au prochain épisode, ils vont en avoir. Est-ce qu'on va voir? Vous allez voir ce que ça donne. Bon. 10 interceptions pour moi, c'était un gros match en interception. 14 passes décisives encore. C'était un gros match en passes décisives et tout va bien dans ce petit mois de carrière. Bien plaisant. Je trouve ça trop difficile. J'aime bien avoir du, des nouveaux trucs, des nouvelles affaires. Ouais, les difficultés non, non si difficiles, c'est quand même plaisant. Là. Donc, et voilà, c'est quand même cette. Deuxième épisode de Smart Carrière avec Harry Irving. Je vous remercie d'avoir été là et je vous dis à la prochaine. Salut tout le monde!